This is Dabu7. You were looking at the Tropic Mimic map, and I got to give a shout out to Dutch that uh, put a video out on this in regards to this massive wave of energy that you see that is being picked up here as it hits the Earth. And not only can you see it here on the Mimic map, but what's interesting is over at Space Weather right now, they're saying auroras, no sunspots required. And a lot of people out there believe that CMEs have to be impacting the planet to cause auroras. But the fact is, is that that's not the case. All it takes is energy particles. That could come from a wave of energy that's incoming. It could also come from a solar stream from, say, a coronal hole. But if there's no coronal hole winds and there's other energy incoming, it's going to cause this. Now, the poles, mysterious. I talk about it all the time, the North and South Pole, and the auroras that are let off in some of these areas are unique in color and in size to both poles, depending on what kind of energy is impacting the poles. But with this event, you can see there is a massive repercussion here as whatever wavelength this, this uh, was picking up on it caught this energy hitting the earth and you can see it's just absolutely massive now I'm gonna leave links in the description box make sure you check out Dutch's video he shows how here in the past couple years there's been X flares and when the X flares hit the planet there's anomalies as well but even from an X flare this anomaly puts it to shame this is just a massive wave of energy that is coming over the planet and I talked about this a couple weeks ago in regards to this unknown burst of energy, wave of energy coming toward Earth. And this could be the effects of just that. Like I said, no sunspots, anything of that nature. And we've also seen picked up off of these maps, uh, them doing other geoengineering, weather modification. You could see the islands sometimes emanating in their little stations out in the ocean emanating these rings that were affecting the atmosphere and with harp what they do is they hit the upper ionosphere with heat so you're going to see this you're going to see the reflection of what they're doing the frequency and everything come through and bleed through on some of these maps and like dutch said it's unintentional they never expected this to happen and hoping that guys aren't sitting around seeing these little things but we are and it's happening and as of right now, this is one of the biggest anomalies I've ever seen from a wave of energy come through and show up here on the Mimic Maps. So, interesting indeed. We'll keep an eye on it here and see if uh, there's any changes, uh, if it continues. Also, keep your eyes peeled for more videos. Been hemmed up here as of late uh, on the road. Without a power cord, I'm back in business now, hopefully. Also, look, hopefully go live from the drone. So stay tuned for more videos. And make sure you're subscribed here to Dabu77. Also, my other channel, Dabu777. And that you're following me on Twitter for the latest updates. Much love, y'all.